Yeah. In this beautiful morning, we all gather here at Union Church to celebrate the conferral of an honorary doctorate on Reverend Neil Cole. This is not merely a moment of celebrating, but also a moment of remembering and praying for Reverend Cole's devotion, lifelong devotion, to multiplying the DNA of Christ's kingdom of God and the Christ churches and the world. I heartily welcome you all to this meaningful ceremony. Please join us as we celebrate this memorable moment of AU's history in joyfulness, praises, and prayers. Let us begin the, this ceremony with a word of prayer. Please join in one heart as we offer up an opening prayer to the Lord. Lord, today we gather here to celebrate the awarding of a doctorate upon your faithful servant, Reverend Neil Cole. At the beginning of this ceremony, we offer up our words of prayer and invite your presence amongst our gathering. Lord, pour your Holy Spirit upon us and bless Reverend Cole and all of us as we proceed with this ceremony. At this time, we would like to publicly recognize Reverend Cole's contributions to your church your kingdom, and AEU. Yet, as we also pray that you will remember his dedication and devotion to his ministry for revitalizing and renewing your churches and continue to mightily use him for your ministry of multiplying the DNA of Jesus Christ. Lord, bless Reverend Cole's family as they continue to sincerely support his ministry and join in his endeavors for your kingdom. We pray that you grant peace and grace upon them in all dimensions of their lives. We offer up this whole ceremony up into your hands and pray that all of what we do in this ceremony will be acceptable to you. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, we pray, amen. Now we move on to the hooding and the awarding of the honorary doctorate on Reverend Neil Cole. Um, first of all, I will read a short biography of Reverend Cole and AU's uh, recognition of his contributions to the church, um, the body of Christ, and ultimately the kingdom of God. Um, his full name is Cornelius Cole IV. <laughs> um, New Cole was born in Santa Monica in California in 1960. After graduating from Palisades High School in 1979, he went on to study at California State University, Long Beach, where he not only earned a Bachelor of Arts degree in Fine Art with a minor in Speech Communications, but also became a disciple of Jesus Christ and husband to Dana for 38 years now. During his collegiate and graduate years, he served as a lifeguard for LA County at Venice Beach. After graduation from university, he immediately enrolled in Talbot Seminary in Biola University. Halfway through, he was hired by Grace Brethren Church in Long Beach to pastor the collegiates and transfer to Grace Theological Seminary's West Campus Extension, where he earned a Master of Divinity degree with an emphasis in the New Testament. After graduation, he became the lead pastor at Grace Fellowship at Alta Loma, California, where he served for almost 10 years. While serving as the pastor of Grace Fellowship, he began a church planting ministry that later became known as Church Multiplication Associates. In 1998, he and his family moved back to Long Beach, California, where he served as a director of CMA and also began planting a new kind of church to reach young postmodern people in the city. The new churches he launched were initially called Awakening Chapels. These became a new network of organic churches meeting in homes, places of business, 
on campuses and even at local beaches. During this time, he also expanded CMA by launching a training in organic church called Organic Church Planters Greenhouse Training. The number of churches doubled every year for almost 10 years and became too numerous to count. The churches expanded to every state and over 60 nations of the world in 10 years. Since then, Neil has also launched Starling Initiatives, which connects people doing kingdom work around the world, publishes new books relevant to organic church movement, and posts video trainings. Neil has authored 17 books that have been translated into 15 languages around the globe. In the last few years, Neil has taught a few different courses at AU. He taught one PhD course, one MDiv and Demin course, and, be, um, and has been teaching practicum as a professor for a class made of um, ESL students from all over the world. Accordingly, AEU recognized his ministry and confers this honorary doctor of divinity degree upon Reverend Neil Cole to commemorate his excellency and lifelong dedication in his ministry for the kingdom of God and his outstanding contribution for AEU as a professor. AEU is pleased to make this decision according to the degree conferral stipulations prescribed by B BPPE and ABHE and through the agreement of the board of the trustees. Um, Dr. Lee, the president of AEU, and Dr. Kim, the uh, chairman of the board of trustees, will step up to the front and proceed with this hooding ceremony. I'm going to pray for uh, Dr. Neil Cole. Heavenly Father, we exalt you, you who is worthy of glory, honor, and praise. This time, the AEU comfort an honorary doctorate to your dear servant, Neil Cole. I believe that this goes beyond acknowledging the precious work he has done so far and is a preparation for what God wants to do through him in the future. We pray that God will re reveal his kingdom and glory through Neil. Now, according to the word of the Lord, we send him back into the world. Please make him stronger and use him more preciously. I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus, looking forward to what the Lord will accomplish. Now we will present um, his certificate of doctorate degree as well as a plaque in commemorating his ministry and um, his doctorate degree. On the recommendation of the faculty and, the by, uh, and by the approval of the Board of Trustees confers the degree of Doctor of Divinity with all rights, benefits, and privileges pertaining thereunto upon Reverend Cornelius Cole Ford, in witness of the signature of the appropriate officers and the seal of America Evangelical University are hereunto affixed on August 20th, in the year of the Lord, 2021. And we also present a plaque to Dr. Cole um, congratulations, as a minister 
and Christian leader, you have committed your whole life to evangelization of the world. In recognition and honoring of your leadership and services, we gladly comfort this plague of congratulation. He said to them, go into all the world and preach the gospel to all creation. Mark 16, 15. On the date of August 20th, 2021, but, uh, presented by Dr. Kim Sin Il. Thank you. And now, Dr. Sang Woon Lee, the president of AEU, will come up to the pulpit to offer a congratulatory remark for Dr. Neil Cole. Uh, today, I'm very grateful to be conferring the AEU honorary doctorate on Pastor Neil Cole. Neil is a well-known influential activist, a dedicated in the re renewal of the church. He's the one uh, who revealed the call to restore the appearance of the early church by returning to the Bible when the churches were bound in traditions and customs, not in the world, but in actions. This gave rise to the house church movement, organic church movement, which spread not only in California, but throughout the United States and around the world. He has written over 17 outstanding books and has lectured worldwide. His writing and lectures has become prophetic ministry that suggests the direction of the church should take in this age. It is great honor for us, the AEU, to be able to confer an honorary doctorate on him. AEU is an emerging young seminary. 20 years ago, AEU was established with the vision of training the holy people of the world in this land to raise up workers for the kingdom of God. Since then, it has continued to develop and became an official university recognized by the U.S. Department of Education and is establishing itself as a healthy and substantial school among Korean seminaries in the United States. Recently, the AEU is putting more effort into becoming a school that offers alternative for this era. First, you want to start a church movement by educating Korean diaspora leaders scattered around the world through online. Furthermore, Starting this year, we are preparing to train native leaders in the mission field. I sincerely hope that we can raise mission leaders not only in Korea but around the world to evoke the kingdom movement together. Professor Neil Cole is prepared for such a ministry, and when he does this with us, he will play a significant role in helping AEU grow into a global university. Once again, congratulations to Dr. Neil Cole. I look forward to Dr. Neil Cole's future ministry. I hope that you can go down the road together, and I bless you. Um, thank you very much, Dr. Lee. And at this time, Dr. Kim, the chairman of the Board of Trustees of AEU, will step up to the front and offer a, congr a congratulatory remark for Dr. Neil Cole. As a chairman of the Board of Trustees for AEU, I'm very pleased to congratulate and confer the honorary doctorate for Reverend Dr. Neil Cole today. Uh, he is a, a passionate man to build the foundation of and expanded it 
of the kingdom of God here in Southern California and all around the world. Uh, as a missional church activist, he upgraded our perspective from our building-centered faith life to more wide missional field. Uh, as a church planter, he multiplied hundreds of small churches and cultivated them organically. And as a professor, he provided incredible insight on how to practice leadership within missional church settings. 한국말로 잠깐 할게요. 우리 미성대학교 이사장으로 오늘 닐콜 목사님 명예 박사학위 수여하게 돼서 참 기쁘고 영광스럽게 생각합니다. 아, 그동안 목사님 이곳 남가주는 물론이거니와 세계 곳곳에 어, 하나님 나라를 위해서 열심히 수고해 오셨고요. 어, 선교적 교회 운동의 실천가로 또 개척 교회 목회자로 그리고 훌륭한 교수로 또 저술가로 어, 목사님 오늘까지 많은 교회들과 우리 리더들에게 선한 영향력을 끼쳐오고 계십니다. 그 모든 수고들 우리가 인정하고 기리고 또 격려하는 의미로 오늘 우리 학교가 명예 박사학위를 수여하게 되었습니다. Therefore, I am very honored to say that Reverend Dr. Neil Cole is the right person to deserve this honorary doctorate. 축하합니다. Congratulations, Dr. Neil Cole. Dr. <laughs> Dr. Neil Cole will come up to the front and respond to the two um, congratulatory remarks. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, I, honor is, if you think of honor like a currency, um, it's a strange sort of a thing that uh, to receive. It's, it, the people who value it, or the people who understand it the least, seem to receive it the most. In, I, lived, I grew up in the Hollywood area, and every year we'd have 10 ceremonies with red carpets to honor people who are not good people, but pretend to be good people. And that's kind of the, the way honor works in the U.S., but we're not very good at it. Um, I find when I travel overseas, I, I discover that honor is something much more valuable than what we give here in the States. There's a young man that I met once at a cafe in Long Beach. His name is Colin. He was troubled and having a difficult time. I did not give him a lot of time. I just listened to him. I asked him a question or two, and I told him a little bit about Jesus. I didn't think much of my comments or the moment. I just went home after that and probably forgot about that, that whole experience. But that young man gave his life to Christ shortly after that. And he went on to follow Christ. And as today, he's on the staff of a large church in Long Beach. And uh, whenever I am discouraged, whenever I am feeling like my work is not known and not fruitful, and I begin to question myself, God arranges for me to bump into Colin somewhere. And he gushes to me about what a difference I made in his life and how important I am to him. I think that we don't serve Jesus for these kinds of honor, but God knows sometimes we need honor. And in the midst of our difficult work, he gives us moments like this one, where we are presented with honor that we'd never expected. And I give you thanks for that. And uh, we all live for that one day where we will hear, well done, good and faithful servant. But in the meantime, I am receiving this honor with gratitude. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dr. Nuko, for your very impressive and uh, very heartwarming response to the congratulatory remarks. Before ending, I want to recognize the presence of all of our audience in the midst of ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. And we uh, pray that all of you and your family will be uh, safe and secure in the protective hand of the Lord all the way through, throughout this pandemic. Um, I'll offer up a benediction. Please join the prayer. The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with Dr. Reverend Neil Cole and his family and his ministry for your kingdom, as well as upon us 
upon all of us who gather here to celebrate at this ceremony now and forever. Amen. <laughs>